This is my first tutorial. Um, I'm going to show you how to uh, make your own brush and install it and then you can use it freely. You don't have to follow what I do. You can um, just apply your image to the same steps that I do. Okay, so go into file and start up a new canvas. You don't have to name it at the moment, you can name it once you've saved it. Just do a 640 width by 480 height. Um, doesn't matter about the resolution, I've, uh, I've got it at 300, you could have it at 72, which is its normal you know, preset one, so uh, it doesn't really matter. And you want to choose transparent as your background contents. Okay, click OK. Uh, and uh, you got your canvas set. Now, uh, I'm going to do an Apple logo as a, as a brush, so what you need to do is download your um, your image that you want to make a brush in Photoshop uh, open it and then you still got your blank layer here so it should come up in another tab okay so you've got it here right go into your magic one tool and select the two bits you want uh, uh, if you're on Apple press command C to copy it or Control C from Windows. Uh, then move over to your uh, set canvas size, which you started off with. Uh, press uh, Control V or Apple V, um, and there you go. Your your things there. Um, now what you can do is um, is then. Uh, Go into image, go into mode, and turn it to grayscale. You have to do that. Uh, choose discard, then edit. Um, define brush set, name it. So I'm going to name mine Apple. And then click OK. Now that, now should be uh, in your brushes tool. You can go in to um, uh, go into your brushes, scroll down, and there you go. And you can use it freely. If I do another uh, another canvas. I can use it now. I've got a weird colour selection on at the moment. Uh, click it a few times. And ta! You've now made your brush. And it's saved straight away into your brush uh, dialog box up here. You can change the size of it. And go right down here. Have a mini Apple logo. But as you see, you can apply this to any image. You don't even have to have this alpha background, you could have a white background or whatever background it is. But this magic wand tool over here, once you click and use it, you know, it'll just select what you want. It's just because these two are joined here that it selected that. But um yeah, you